Hello, I'm Entrelissim, and welcome to Space Hulk Deathwing. So, for those of you who don't know what Space Hulk Deathwing is, um, basically the Warhammer 40k universe where everything is grimdark and there is a race of genetically enhanced super soldiers called Space Marines. Um, Space Hulk Deathwing is basically set where you are one of those genetically enhanced super soldiers called Space Marines who is like the best of the best. You wear like this badass Terminator armor which is uh, really badass and really thick. And the Space Hulks are basically um, ships, or more precisely amalgamations of ships quite often, where they've kind of drifted through the warp, which is kind of this alternate reality that you jump through to like go into FTL basically, and is really nasty and there are demons there, etc. And then they come back into real space and sometimes they've got cool technology on board and stuff that we need to find out about because we've kind of gone into a technological backwater. Not that you want to say that because the Imperium of Man will kill you for it. Uh, so yeah, you go on board and you're trying to like clean out the bad stuff in there to be able to get the Space Hulk back under control so that you can loot it for core technology. And as a, one of these Space Marines, you get put on the front line with your lovely Terminator armor to go and fight all the Grippies inside. So, I'm gonna dive in with continue campaign just because I want to skip the tutorial which I did earlier. Chapter 01, the Power XL ship. Which honestly is probably the worst names for ship I've ever heard. You are entering Power XL ship. Okay. Let's start a mission. This is not the ship we're entering. This is our strike cruiser. Um, which is a space marine ship. Recovering Imperial data. This is Grand Master Belial. Addressing all warriors of the First Company. Forged from countless ships in the seething forces of warp space, a space hulk has been deposited here by the uncaring tides of the Immaterium. I have dubbed this drifting lair of abominations Olethros. Okay, good name. A hive swarm of Tyranids already besets the system. So while the honored warriors of the Death Wing embark upon the purging of this space hulk, our brothers shall assist the Astra Militarum and Imperial Navy in destroying this tendril of the Great Devourer. Command of the assault belongs to an epistolary of the Librarian, a deadly battle psyker of the chapter. Leading a specially assembled squad, the Librarian will investigate abnormal augur returns and psychic emanations from within the space hulk. Yeah, I will. Premonitions. The ether gifts me visions. I see a threat far more deadly than gene hungry tyrants. A scream and a dark promise. A ship in the shadow, a relic from our secret past. I feel the tightness in my gut as I see a cataclysm as yet unseen. The Opera Mortalis descends upon us. The shadow of death. That bodes well. Brothers, the first scans of the Space Hulk have revealed a dark angel ship that dates back to the Age of Heresy. It is located in the heart of the Olethros Space Hulk. This ship from our ancestors seems to be protected by a mysterious energy field. Teleportation to the ship is currently impossible. The only way to reach it is through the main mass of the Space Hulk. Reaching this ship is your primary concern. Trust your battle brothers to deal with the rest of the Olethros. Brothers, retribution is at hand. It is our strength. We are the sons of Caliban. Let fury guide your weapons. Let vengeance be your song. We are the angels of death, and our enemies shall fall! Tatting in face briefing. Brother Librarian, the initial boarding strike is proceeding, but we have lost contact with Squad Gideon. Your sensorium should receive Gideon's beacon signal, though it will be weak. We need Squad Gideon to secure the breaching zone. Locate them as quickly as possible. When you are successful, proceed to secure the landing area to establish the full bridgehead. Praise the lion. Okay, uh, let us deploy. Now, we get uh, a number of choices here. So, we could, like, have a different weapon, although we can't because I don't think we've unlocked them. Yes, yeah, so you need to retrieve these pieces of equipment. 
Oh, uh, we could we can actually be a librarian with like a hellfire, an assault. Ca oh my god, we can have like lining clot. This is pretty awesome. Thunder hammer makes it. Over here, we get a choice between a few different bits of equipment. We've got a force sword at the moment. We could have a power fist, like really slow, cumbersome, like fist sheathed in sort of this energy that disrupts matter. We could have a lost mace of Coswain, which is the same stats as a power fist. Uh, but we're going to go with the force sword, even though it's the default, because it offers a 40% bonus on spell cooldown. So that's probably a uh, good choice to go with. And I guess we're stuck with the uh, storm bottle for the moment. Storm bottle being like someone went, you know what, what would be cool if we had like two guns and we stapled them together? Cool, that's cool. Right, we'll do that. Now, what happens if the guns fired rocket propelled explosive shells instead of just bullets? It's pretty badass. Let's deploy. Hi. Okay, we're good to go. I'm in place. The power carrier, XL class. Right. Brother librarian, command Barakil to follow you. He will protect your back. So, we start seeking for Gideon Squad. We're sending Gideon's beacon channel to you. Follow me. Swift vengeance. Right. Where are they? Gideon's over there. Let's go this way. Hello. Ooh, hello. I really like the fact we use a boarding torpedo rather than the, just a the teleporter. And the teleporter's easy, right? It's just a, it's easy hand way, way of going, oh, you get there. But the boarding torpedo's really 40k, like... Ooh, and you've got a power fist? Oh, man. Right. The apothecary there in the front, he's the one that's going to be healing everyone up when everything goes drastically wrong. Okay, hello? Okay, let's go this way. I mean, I don't want to say it's quite too quiet. But I think you get the gist. Oh, I like, right, we can go down here. I'm going to jump out of my skin. That, that ladder is too narrow for my bulk. I mean, I'm not saying I'm bulky, but... Ooh. Oh. Okay, that door does not work. I mean, it probably hasn't, like, worked in a few millennia, so I can understand that. Is that like a tech priest or a servitor? Hmm. Okay, I think we're going to have to go up this ramp here. Okay. Looks fine so far. Hello. Hello. Easy stored working. Yes. Just. It's a bit iffy there. Oh, yep, definitely Mechanicus. And they've all died. So those of you who don't know, the Mechanicus are basically the people who run all the technology in the Imperium. I can't fall down there. Can we go this way? No. Seriously, is that it? It just stops here. Oh. Hmm. Right, this, this entrance wasn't of much use. Let's go down here. Right, let's look at our map. Maybe our map will be able to help us.
Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go back and lock this door just in case enemies spawn out of here. And then we're going to go through here and we're going to go through area 101 up into the scriptorum. And we'll go over to the liquid node. Apparently there's no direct access through here. Probably should have checked the map first. Right, we're going to go this way. I'm glad I can pass through friendlies, otherwise that would be a real problem. Oh, did you hear that? I thought I heard something go like creak. I'm not worried. You're worried. Right, so that's my other like psychic ability, which does like an air effect, I think. Can I like there we go. Lock. Oh yeah. Right. Somewhere over here, there's a door. Ha ha! Okay. All good so far. There's going to be a cakewalk. No issues whatsoever. Right. If we go directly head into the scriptorum... Oh, oh this is actually really annoying. Um, I really don't like how they've done this map. Um, open here. Oh, hello. Omnistan knows all. Comprehends all. The sensor has detected a vessel belonging to the ancient time of the Est Legions Astarte and the Mechanicum. Indications it is in good condition. With reach of this vessel, it is likely to contain ancient machines, data, and relics. Securing these treasures is absolute priority. Ah, so they tried to board looking for the same vessel that we were looking for. But they did like actually try and board it with their ship rather than just with a boarding torpedo presumably and then this happened this is why space hulks are bad juju all right let's go through here okay it's quiet enemies Part of an enemy. So there are gene stealers about. Gene stealers are basically the aliens from Alien. And that is a gene stealer head and a arm. And viscera, I think is what you'd call it. Right, is this the right? Yes, it is. Ooh, there is a gun here. Hi, can I, like, access that gun? Turret. No, okay. In which case, we just need to take this route. Okay, those are bits of hand. It's safe. This is safe. I'm in my happy place. I'm a space marine. I don't need to be scared. Happy place. The motion detector stopped moving. Uh, we need to take this, and then we take the next left. Happy place. Happy place. That's not a happy place. But press in power lets me see a prediction of the future. That's not a nice prediction. Oh god. Brother Nahum. Yeah, 
Um, I can't send you back because I need a medic. You're kidding, right? Stupid goddamn doors. Had enough of that. Okay. So we probably want to go down here. It was the next left, wasn't it? Yes. Don't you dare. Good. Good door. You saw what happened to your friend. If you mess with me... Brothers. I'm just going to block this door. Actually, this is the control. We should probably go into the control room, right? Oh, one too many. Control room. Hello? Is there anybody here? There might be some sort of useful information here. Hello? Hello? No, there is nothing useful here. Okay, run away. I hear whispering. That is not a good sign. That's you, Brother Nathan, right? You just whispering in the background? I'm going to jump out of my skin the first time a gene stealer appears. It's safe to be in this big pipe thing, right? Server skull. Server skulls kind of belong to the Mechanicus, so I presume it's part of the ship. Nope. Oh. No, this does not look good. No, oh, no. No, no. Of course we've got an anomalous signal return. It would just be too much for like equipment was working, right? Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. God damn doors! Okay. What is up here? Ooh. Scepter of power. Relics of a dark angel from the time of the Great Crusader scattered throughout the Space Hulk recover them all. Don't mind if I do. Does it do anything? No. Okay. Sensorium is showing multiple returns in your area. Stay vigilant. Dead ahead. Mm, just a server skull. That's just so dangerous to be like, oh, that's just a server skull, and then suddenly, like, the gene steals pop down and we die. Which way are we going? We're meant to be going the other way. I am a battle trained warrior, hardened from centuries of combat. Just, you know, don't ask me to read a map. We got this. Oh, no, yeah, you, you haven't got this. Terminator armor is expensive. And by expensive, I mean, you know, it's an arcane, like, artifact that takes, like, ages to produce, or they aren't produced anymore or something, and, yeah. Oh, check the vent shaft. Well, this is going to go well. Oh, okay. Oh. 
Yeah. Just check this really weird fan with bodies laying in front of it. That's never going to go wrong. Oh, okay, just get to the fan. Check the fan. Oh, enemies. Oh, hello, 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 hello. No, no, go away. Lightning, lightning, lightning. Air effect. Die. Lightning. More lightning. Blade, 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 blade. More killing, shooting things. Blade, blade. Reactivate the defense grid at any cost. Our foes approach quickly. We must reactivate local defensive systems to secure the bridge. Okay. Can you, like, heal yourself? There we go. It's kind of annoying that I have to order you to heal yourself. Ugh. Uh, also heal you. There we go. I'm fine for health at the moment, so... We call. Okay, activate the generators. Where are these generators? All the way over here, that's fine. What could possibly go wrong when we make our way all the way across there? Nothing. Obviously. Gene Stealer, okay. The ultimate shock trooper. Yeah. I don't look forward to fighting more of you, but there's gonna be a lot more of you to fight. At least I've got my lovely sword. It's a lot more effective than my bolter. Right, I guess this is a good place to end this episode. Uh, we're now in a space hulk with lots of bodies around us. Our friends are dead. We are receiving strange signal echoes. Cool. Yep, that's good news. Uh, but yeah, if you've liked, please remember to like, not subscribe. Please consider subscribing. Also, uh, consider leaving a comment down below, especially because it is a new series and everything. It is, oh god damn it. It's always good to uh, gauge how people are liking something. God damn it. Die. What you die already. In the name of the Emperor. Please just go down. Reloading, reloading, reloading. Yet yeah, they're going to get to me. Ooh, clever. Clever girl. But until next time... Stay shiny. Ah!